I have another garage sale haul for you. So to, this weekend was a local um, like citywide garage sale in a bigger town um, about 20, 30 minutes from us. And I went and I will say it was so hot. It has been, the heat index has been in the hundreds to 120s here and it has been unbearably hot. Now, it did rain that morning, so we got kind of a late, or I got kind of a late, it was just me, got kind of a late start, and I don't know, it just, the humidity, and so, and it, I did go to about 20 garage sales, but I didn't find a lot. Um, it wasn't, you know, but what I did find, I loved, and then I have another, of course, as you see in the picture, DIY project, and you see that, but I, yeah, I just, I loved it, and, um, so I did pick up a few things, so I wanted to share with you as always. I only picked up a couple clothing items this week. I did pick up an Aeropostle shirt for um, either my husband or my son. They are so close in sizes um, now that um, sometimes they'll just share or they'll basically try it on and basically whichever one um, fits them better. Um, my son tends to wear a, like a small in um, adults and my husband wears a medium, but um, sometimes things fit better on one or the other and so they will do that. So I bought um, a t-shirt for them. Oh, and I gave um, 50 cents for that. And then I bought one shirt for myself that I always that I also gave 50 cents for and it is um, it's kind of a shirt kind of a dress can you see that I don't know I can't see the camera so I'm not really sure but anyway it um, hopefully it's not too big um, sometimes I I have a hard time because I've lost weight um, figuring out what size to buy so anyway it's kind of like um, a dress it, well it is a dress but I would wear it with like leggings instead of like um, um, tights or something just because I'm just kind of a little modest. It's, a little, it's real short. But anyway, um, it was also 50 cents and I thought it was beautiful and it is, um, it's just a new, it's a New Directions brand and so I thought that was really nice. I thought that might be nice to wear to work or something like that. So I, that was the only two clothing items that I bought. Okay, so another um, garage sale find I was this, um, it's like those old windows. I've been restoring old windows um, and doing like cricket lettering and things, excuse me, <coughs> on them. And so um, I've been, I'm always looking for windows and I actually bought some, I'll show you in, in the next clip um, at a flea market because I know that they normally have them. But I found this at a garage sale and it was $5 and they, um, they have uh, painted, it's still got the glass, but they've got painted chalkboard paint um, on one side and at first I was like oh, I don't know because I mean the other side is dark like you could I can put um, like uh, I don't want to blind you and hold it up but uh, with the lights but I could put like really bright lettering or something on it but I just wasn't sure and I wasn't sure about the chalkboard and so at first I didn't get it but then I decided to and I'm glad I did because I think what I'm going to use it for is at my craft shows that I have these windows and stuff I can write like you know windows you know $20 wh whatever you know however much the different things are and I thought that would be a great um a great a signage kind of piece so it was like I said five dollars and I will need to paint it and this one's not painted I don't know what's with that and then these are white so I'm sure that I will sand that and paint that different um something okay and then I did go over to the local flea market and picked up the uh, windows so let's go um I want to show you the rest of the things I bought but they are outside so I'll take you out there Okay guys, so here are the windows that I bought. I bought um, seven of them. Um, this one's a little bit thinner than the others, but then these are all the same. And I gave $3 a piece for those. And this is my favorite find. This is an old milk can. And I've been looking for one of these for a while. They are always very, very expensive. In fact, I just saw one today at a flea market that I stopped at as well. And it was $55 and I gave $10 for this. It does have um, this top thing and I think it's kind of rusty. <laughs> like saying it's rusty. Yep. We're going to paint it though. And it's kind of on, kind of off. I don't know. We're going to see if we can get it off or 
maybe just end up hammering it down. I'm not sure. Anyway, we'll see what we can do with that. Um, that might involve a husband. But anyway, Mom, that's what I got. So those are the things. And as you can see from the cover clip, which I will insert directly after this, I did do a makeover project with my milk can. I was very, I want to talk about the milk can. I was very excited about, oh, I, I forgot to tell you prices. <laughs> I gave, um, I think, anyway, I gave $5 for the chalkboard windows and $3 a piece for the um, windows at the flea market. And then the tin can, the milk can, I did give $10 for, which is a total bargain. I saw one at the flea market right afterwards for 55 they are so expensive and I've been wanting one for so long and not only that but this one is actually um, from the carnation company and it was um, from a local plant just like 10 miles away from our home so the idea to not only have one but to have one that was used locally is Kind of, kind of special. But anyway, um, that's what I got for this week, and that's my makeover for this week. Um, what kind of things have you guys gotten? Have you gotten any bargains? Have you done any DIYs or makeovers? Leave me a comment. Leave me a video link. I'd love to see what you guys are doing with the things that you find at garage sales. So anyway, thanks, guys.